Hi, boys and girls. Well, today's story is called The Wind Blew, and it's written and illustrated by Pat Hutchins. Did you know that the wind is a force? Yeah, the wind can push and pull things, and we know a push and a pull is a force. Well, in this story, the wind is a bit of a troublesome force. Sometimes the wind can be a helpful force, like when it turns the turbines so we can get electricity. And other times, it can be a bit of a nuisance, like in this case. Well, let's find out how the wind is a force in this story. That's a bit of a nuisance. The wind blew. The wind blew. We can really see how it is bending the trees. It is forcing them over. It is pushing them over. The wind blew. Wow, really is blowing that man, pushing him along. It's trying to pull the umbrella out of his hands by pushing it up. Oh, and sure enough, it did. It took the umbrella from Mr. White and quickly turned it inside out. What else do you see in this picture? What's that little girl got? I wonder if that's the next item to be taken. Oh, and yes, it is. It snatched the balloon from little Priscilla and swept it up to join the umbrella. I wonder if something to do with the wedding down here will be next. That's my prediction. It's a picture clue. And not content, it took the hat and still not satisfied with that. Hmm, what other picture clue can we see here? It whipped a kite into the air and kept it spinning round up there. Ooh, I see the next picture clue. Do you notice it? So now we've had the umbrella, the balloon, the hat, the kite. Hmm. It grabbed a shirt left out to dry and tossed it up into the sky. I wonder what it's going to take from the lady in the corner. Hmm, I wonder if it'll take her handkerchief. See how she's blowing her nose? It's definitely pulled these items up to the air and now it's pushing them along out of the reach of the people. It plucked a hanky from a nose, and up and up and up it rose. Hmm. And now down here, we've got a judge. I wonder what it's going to take from him. What do you think? It lifted the wig from the judge's head and didn't drop it back. Instead... Who's coming next into the picture? I wonder what it will take from him. <gasps> it whirled the postman's letters up as if it hadn't done enough. Hmm. I wonder who's going to be the next victim. Who is going to be the next person who is affected by the force of the wind? It blew so hard it quickly stole a striped flag fluttering on a pole. Hmm. Those two little girls. I wonder what the wind will take from them. Seems to be in a very taking mood today. 
pulling things away from people and then pushing them up into the air out of the reach of the people who they belong to. So we had an umbrella and we've had a balloon and a hat and a shirt and a kite and a hanky and a wig and some letters. Now we've got a flag. These people look a little bit upset with the wind. This is definitely a day where the wind is being a force that is a nuisance. It pulled the new scarves from the twins and tossed them to the other things. Uh -huh. Down here, it says gale force winds. So when you hear about gale force winds, it's talking about very strong winds and it's made the newspaper. Oh, I wonder if that will be the next thing that gets stolen, pulled from somebody and pushed up into the air. Hmm, let's see. Sure enough, it sent the newspapers fluttering round and then got tired of the things it found. Well, if the wind is tired now, what do you think it's going to do? What's your prediction? If it's pulled all these things up and away and pushed them along out of the reach of the people. It mixed them up and threw them down. Hmm. Now, scientists, would it really push them down or did another force take over? I agree with you. I think another force took over a pulling force that keeps us all here. And what would that be? Right, gravity. So the wind has mixed everything up, and let it go, and gravity's pulled it down. And now all these people have their things back, but do the right people have the right things? Hmm. And blew away to see. So the wind is taking over, being a force of another kind. At least when it blew out to sea, now it's being a useful force. It is filling the sail of the boat and helping to push it along, give it motion. Nice. Well, like I said, the wind can be very useful and sometimes a bit of a nuisance. So scroll on down and find out what your assignment is to do with the wind.